Greetings everybody. It's week two of the portfolio and I decided to add two more ETFs, Bills and SJNK. Bills is a three to 12 month treasury bill ETF and SJNK is a short term high yield junk bond ETF. The reason I decided to add them is because I'd like a higher dividend yield slash cash flow from the portfolio and these two ETFs help accomplish that. Bills provides about a 5.39% dividend and SJNK has about a 7.32% dividend. I say about because their dividend isn't the same every month, but it usually stays close to those percentage ranges. And yes, I did say every month, which means these two ETFs pay their dividends monthly. Anyway, on day one of week two, I purchased 15 shares of bills and one share of SJNK and ended the day with a $1.96 gain, which is a 0.11% return. The dividend yield is now 5%, which is about $7.49 a month. Prior to the purchase of Bills and SJNK, the monthly dividend was $0.65 cents with a 2.8% yield. On day two, I purchased two more shares of Bills and one more share of SJNK and ended the day with the total portfolio gain of $2.39, which is 0.12%. On day three, I sold the two SJNK shares because I changed my mind about this ETF long term. I purchased an additional share of bills and one more share of SPTL, which is the long term treasuries ETF, and I ended the day with a $3.23 gain, which is 0.15%. On day four, it was Thanksgiving and the markets were closed. On day five, the last day of week two, I noticed the difference between SPTL's gains and TBF's losses were constant at $0.10. Cents. On Wednesday, SPTL was up $1.59, while TBF was down $1.49, which is a $0.10 cent difference. On Friday, SPTL was up $0.55 cents and TBF was down $0.45. Cents still a 10 cent difference. This got me thinking that this pattern may continue for as long as I continue to invest similar amounts of money in them. And if they effectively cancel each other out all year long, at the end of a year, I'll only have a 3% gain from the 3% dividend that they provide. Because of this, and since treasury bill ETFs like bills are currently providing a 5% dividend, I decided to sell these two ETFs and instead use bills as the portfolio hedge. I originally included SPTL and TBF as hedges to the S&P 500 so that if or when stocks go on another losing streak, the long-term treasuries or treasury yield ETFs would rise but since having them both makes them cancel each other out for just the 3% dividend, I'd rather use Bills with its 5% dividend as the hedge. Since Bills, being a treasury bill ETF, will not drop when stocks drop. So, I purchased two more Bills and one more S&P 500, and I sold the treasuries and the treasury yields, and I ended the week with a $3.52 gain, which is 0.16%. And I think this will be the end of this mini-series and experiment. Good luck, everybody.